Hey guys, um, I previously told you that I would be putting out of this week's winning stocks every weekend to show you um, how the stocks are progressing on our watch list. And when I say our watch list, I'm referring to fundamentally sound stocks that are at or near their annual low price, their 52-week low price. So, having said that, now I want to show you how you can use um, this, this week's winning stocks because, believe it or not, even though I put it out for you guys, it helps me as well. Because when the week is wrapping up, I'm looking through the this week's winning stocks to see what stocks have the potential of moving up on the next week. And then what I do is I go back through it when the market's open Monday morning. And if Monday morning is a shaking day, even Tuesday morning, and I see what stuff is moving up and what stuff is moving down. If I'm holding something that's starting to move down, I may reflect whether I should keep holding it or let it go. And some things I've let go as a result of this week's winning stocks. And if I see an opportunity of something that's moving back up, I may jump in and buy a few shares of it. So I just wanted to go through with you guys how you can best utilize this week's winning stocks. So we're looking at a stock that was previously mentioned in this week's winning stocks, and that is Waters Corporation. It's a one star. Notice my stocks are in three grades. They're three stars. Those are the most fundamentally sound. Two stars, a little under that, and three stars, a little under that. But I found them all to be fundamentally sound enough to invest in. I just grade them in tiers of which is the most fundamentally sound. So in any event, Waters Corporation is a one star. We see a green candle. We don't know what's going to happen going into Monday. Monday morning, we wake up. We look at our this week's winning stocks again. And we go to our candlestick chart. I'm going to leave some links in the description to a couple of YouTube videos that you could look at to learn some basic skills on reading candlestick charts. And then you can go to tradingview.com and um, get your own candlestick charts so that now, Monday morning, you can go through the candlestick charts of the things I mentioned in this week's winning stocks to see if they're moving up or they're moving down. So now we go to the candlestick chart and we look at Waters Corporation on Monday and what do we see? We see a little red. It's not moving down significantly, but it's moving down. I don't want to jump into that one. I want to leave it alone. On the other hand, we keep looking through this week's winning stocks. Now, bear in mind, a lot of things are down in the market now. We normally don't have this many companies down. So we have a lot of stocks to go through. But in normal times, you may have around maybe five at the most or maybe two or three stocks in a, in a week that are down fundamentally sound and they're down at their 52 week low um so but 
it, that's a more opportunity for us if there's more stocks. So that let's look at another company. Now we're looking at another stock previously mentioned, Quest Diagnostics. It's a two star, a little higher, and we see it's been moving up for the past two weeks. So we go to our candlestick chart on our computer and we put in a ticker symbol TGX and we check Quest Diagnostics. And what do we see? We see that it moved it two candlesticks and moved up for the two weeks, right? So here's one week, here's the second week, and now here it is early Monday, and look, it's moving up for the third week. That may be an opportunity where we want to jump in. Now, one thing I want to mention, guys. Like I said, I analyze all of these companies. I don't want you to trust in my word that I analyze these companies and it looks good. This is where you're putting your money down. You want your money to work for you so that you don't have to keep going out and working for your money, right? You want your money to work for you. You should be looking at these companies and doing an analysis. You see Quest Diagnostics, you're interested in buying it. You may check my channel, see if I already have an analysis video on Quest Diagnostics. If I don't, just leave a comment asking me to analyze Quest Diagnostics for you. Or if you can't reach me through the comment, just send an email. And I'll analyze Quest Diagnostics and leave the video up on the channel for you to view. But you want to move forward with yourself and your family. Maybe the decision is not yours alone. Maybe it's yours and your wife, or so yours and your husband, yours and your boyfriend, yours and your girlfriend. You know what? You guys sit down together, make a bowl of popcorn, cuddle up on the couch, and you guys watch the analysis video together. You're making a decision to move forward in your life and to stop setting the pattern where you're going out and constantly working for money and now you're bringing in money and putting it aside in investments that are working for you. So in any event, I just wanted to tell you guys the best way to use this um this week's winning stocks that I've been putting out and to just let you know you're not the only one using it I use it as well I've just made a couple of changes this morning based on that so um in any event if you got please like these videos um if you're not subscribed subscribe if you guys have any questions, leave me a comment. Also, I put my, uh, at the end of the video, I leave my email up there as well. Um, so you can feel free to reach out to me through email if you have any questions or um, things that you want to tell me. And you guys have a great day.